Welcome to another Photoshop tutorial from tutorvid.com. This tutorial is going to show you how to blur the background in an image uh, to separate the foreground from the background. So the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to duplicate the background. So Control J, we'll do that. And then on this new layer, I'm going to blur this entire layer. So I'll go up to Blur. And Gaussian Blur, Lens Blur, you can choose the one that you like. Uh, put Gaussian Blur and then looking at the background here you can choose how blurry you want it. I'll put around 10 pixels and you can check out the preview if you want. And now to bring back our original image and get this lady unblurred I'll put on a layer mask which is this button over here. And now you can see the layer mask there. If you don't know how layer masks work you can check out a tutorial on those. Now I'm going to brush on this layer mask to hide what's on this blurred layer and show through into this here unblurred layer which is underneath. So I'll grab the brush tool with the letter B and change the brush size with my square brackets and then painting black for a hide. I just have to paint over the girl and then that'll bring her into sharp focus because I'm hiding this blurred layer. And to get on the edges I'll have to zoom in and brush there and if you want to make a selection you could do that I like to use a brush because I can uh, make the edges softer I want and harder on other areas and have a little bit more control and it goes pretty quick so I'll just speed up alright now I'm just finishing up here and I think I've gone through over everything and have everything sharp so now if we zoom out and we hide this blur layer you can see the background gets quite a bit more blurred and the girl stays sharp. If you click back on the original layer, not the layer mask, you can see by this border around here which one is selected. Uh, we can blur it again and you can play with the blur and make the background even blurrier and this foreground lady still stays sharp. And that's it. If you want to download the HD version of this tutorial or download the source files or check out more tutorials, head over to tutorbit.com.